What's up guys? Got an unboxing here of a case for the iPod Touch 4th generation. This one isn't mine, this is a friend's um, iPod. Um, but I ordered a case because, well it's not for me because obviously I don't have an iPod Touch 4G. But it is for my girlfriend, so here it is. Purple, Pixel Skin HD, just like what I have on my phone. I doubt you guys will be able to see it on my phone. Nah, you won't, but yeah. Anyways, let's get straight to the unboxing. So as you can see, this is basically the packaging right here. It's just a piece of cardboard with a thick layer of plastic inside where the case sits in here. And basically that's all you really get. And it's very it's plain and simple packaging, which I kind of like. Now inside, the only thing you do get is the case itself. You get you do not get any screen protector, which kind of sucks. I mean, when you buy a Switch Easy case or anything, it comes with two screen protectors and all that kind of stuff. But, I don't know, I think they should probably upgrade their packaging because for 30 bucks that you do pay for this thing, I think you should at least get a screen protector or something. If we look on the side of this in the back and everything, the cutouts are perfectly cut out. The camera hole is per perfectly cut out. The sleep wake button, it is a bit recessed, but I mean, it's TPU material. I don't expect it to be 100% perfect. On um, the side too, these are the most complicated, I mean the hardest on the push, but I think after a while they'll probably break them in. On um, the bottom, obviously, it's a huge cutout for your speaker, headphone jack, and your 30-pin dock connector, and the front, of course. Now, this is a lay-on-the-table design, so it does have a lip. Now, this obviously is not a real iPod, and if you think that really is, wow, that would be a nice iPod too. See-through, but no, it's not. I'm going to put this on this iPod, and I'm going to just show you guys what it looks like. So, so when you're trying to put this case on, I always recommend going ahead first. As you can see, just stick the two corners in. I'm doing this with one hand, so obviously. And you just work your way around the sides, and there you go. As you can see, it's perfectly cut out on the camera. It's not a big, not too small. I think that's perfect size. The sleep wake button, as I said, it's not as recessed. Now, when you come to here, this is where you kind of have to push a little bit hard, but oh well. And as you can see, it does obviously offer you a lip. So just in case, if you were to set your iPod, let's say flat on the table you wouldn't really have to worry because obviously it has a lay on the table design it has a lip now if you look down here it's a wide cutout for your speaker your 30 pin dock connecting your headphone jack and that's pretty much it guys honestly I do like this case but I think it would probably look much better on a black iPod touch personally I don't find a lot of cases to look that good on white iPod touches and that's the reason why I did not get a white iPhone I kind of like the black and everything, and they just look much better to me. That's my own personal opinion. Leave your opinions down below in the comments down below. Tell me what you guys think. If you guys like this, if not, well, then tell me what you do like. But anyways, guys, this is basically it. As you can see, this pixel skin is perfectly, it's perfect fit and everything. I'm not exactly sure what else I can really say about this case because I know how these cases work. I love them. I've had them for a long time, and I have a bunch of them sitting around here in different colors. But I am thinking about getting a new one for my phone but then again I just got the purple one that I have my phone right now don't know if you can see that so that's about it guys it's basically the unboxing of the purple pixel skin HD for the iPod touch 4th generation if you guys like this video please thumbs up and leave your comments down below if anything like I said I asked you a few questions already and also subscribe if you want to keep updated because I will be putting up more videos throughout this year as I said I'm gonna start working more on YouTube and yeah, here's a one last look at the case. Like I said, it's a perfect fit. Nothing's wrong with it. I really love it, except it would look much better than a black eye pod touch. My opinion. You might have different opinions yourself. I don't know. But anyways, guys, like I said, this is basically it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And like I said, thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys later. See ya!